G'day, I'm Mark from Self Sufficing Me and uh, you've caught us in the action. We've gone out to the pearly grounds. It's about time we got out here. We've been trying to get out to the pearly grounds for a long time, the 70 meter line, thereabouts. We were trying to find pearlies. But at the same time, we're finding no pearlies, but we're starting to catch quite a few fish, a couple of nice snapper. Earlier on, we caught a little sweet lip and now James just landed this excellent tusky, it's 49 centimeters. So we're not getting any pearlies, but we're getting some fish and that's pretty cool. On board we've got Dono, good mate Dono. He's on board with us today, coming along for the ride and we we're hoping we could show him a few fish because he hasn't been out in the water for a while. And it looks like uh, it's coming off. It's pretty busy out here. It was an early start for us and it was a tough ride getting out here. It was a bit choppy, but the worst thing wasn't the chop and it wasn't the wave height or the wind, it was the blooming current. We were pushing against the current all the way out, which made slow going and frustrating ride, but we're out here now and we're catching some good fish, hey James? Yeah, I mean, if you got a fish right here. There he is. So we'll get him up and get him spiked and uh, but just give us a look at it, James. There we go. Cool. Beautiful fish. There you go, there's the school down there, isn't it? The school of snap. Yeah. Cool. School, school, a little small snap. Yeah. Cool. All right, we're moving spots. We're going to what they call the dog's bowl in about 80 meters of water. Hopefully we can see a pearly there. We didn't catch any pearlies in this spot here around the 65, 70 metre mark, so hopefully we can catch something, well, a pearly at least, in this new spot. We'll do a bit of sounding around and then we'll drop down and see what we can do. Let's go. What is it? I mean, that's the type of bus stop you want to cast into. There you go. Another species we don't know. Is that like some type of rast, do you think? Yeah, I reckon yeah, I was about to say that. Well, we tried here at the 80 meter line, no luck. Can't find any pearlies. I think we're gonna call it a day and go back in to the artificial reef in the bay or near the bay. And uh, that's it for the deep sea for us in this section. Hopefully we can pull up a few more fish on the way home. But yeah, the pearlies have evaded us once again. This time it wasn't the weather or the waves, just that we just can't find the fish. To the island now. We're at the artificial reef, left those pearlies way long gone behind, and it's glassed out. Look at it. There's fish on the sounder. But nothing's biting. Oh, the dilemmas. All right, we're gonna keep staying here and prevailing and see what we can pull up.
Well, it's the next morning and we're at our filleting station getting ready to fillet our five catches. They're pretty reasonable. I'm happy with that. It was a fantastic day out in the bay. Absolute cracker. There was plenty of action going on. We would have liked to be in on a lot more of that action, but five will take that any day. I've, we've been out plenty of times and caught nothing. And we had Dono with us and I was happy that he was able to land a few as well. And so it's always nice when you've got a friend on board and you want to show them a good day out. We saw whales, we saw lots of bust ups, everything was happening. So it was one of those days on the water, except on the way back, we didn't get much out of those artificial reefs. We stopped in at Cowan Cowan, we stopped in at the artificial reef just at the nose or northern end of Morton Island there. But unfortunately, they just went completely dead on us. We could see them on the sounder, we just couldn't catch anything. So anyway, we ended up coming back and it was a great day, like I said. So now let's get into filleting these fish, then we'll wrap it up. Well, we've done all right. Some good panties, some nice fillets, flatter and tusky, grassy, different species. Yeah, happy with that. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a fishy thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Share the video around. If you've got mates and that who are into fishing or who are thinking about fishing, remember we're novices, so it's coming from a beginner to novice point of view on fishing. If we can do it, you can do it. It really is a fantastic sport and, you know, something that rewards you with some good fish sometimes as well as a great experience on the water. I encourage everyone to get out there. If you're thinking about it, have a crack at it. Hire a boat. Get a small tinny like we did to start off with and see how you go. Anyway, I'm waffling on. Bye for now. Cheers.